Editing Teespring templates is very simple. Uh, once you unpack the zip file, you will see all these folders, and inside you will see six different designs right here. And also, these are in the two different uh, colors. So first is black, it's a black text, and second is white. You won't see anything, anything here because it's white text, but it can be used for a dark shirt, for example. So edit, editing is very simple. You will need Photoshop to do that. Uh, just double click it. And it opens up. It's quite a big file right now. It's 16.7 percent of the real size. In order to change the text, just press T on your keyboard or select a text uh, type tool function on the left. Then just click on the any of these forms, and you can change the text. For example, keep calm and keep scuba diving. If it's too big, uh, then you have to select the font and make it smaller right here. Um, also, you'll see that uh, sometimes the, the lines may be too much, so you will need to click this, this icon, and you will see here this pops up, and uh, you can change the, the uh, space between lines so it looks better. Um, so it's important to do that. And once you do that, just click OK right here and it's done. And then you can just go to the file, save for web, and choose PNG. I choose PNG two colors. If you have more colors, you can choose eight. But Teespring only allows, I think, ten colors. So a PNG, PNG eight is a good format. And that's how you can save it. You can also change the color of the text. Uh, for example, make it red if you want. You can change the font right here. You can also change the if you want to bold it or not. It's up to you. You can also go and select the move tool or press V on your keyboard and just move it however you want. You can also move it here, move this, and just do whatever you want. So that's basically how you can change the text on these templates. Thank you for watching.